everybody, welcome back to this week's episode of Try It Outdoors. This week we are out on the mighty Lake St. Clair. We've got 69 degree surface temp, and we're going for pike, walleye, and muskie. Ideally, we get a muskie. This is the fish of 10,000 casts, that's what everyone calls it. We're gonna be doing a little trolling for them. Now we've definitely marked some big fish, whether it be muskie or a big pike, on our depth finder. So we're fishing a channel that comes out into the Lake St. Clair. So what it is, is it's really, really deep in the middle because these big ships are coming down through. And then there's big uh, cliffs on the edges. So that's what we're kind of fishing. We're kind of zigzagging on the cliffs, hoping to pick up a muskie. Ideally, we get a muskie today. Ideally, we get a couple pike and maybe a walleye here and there. There's definitely potential to catch fish out here. All right, so gonna give you guys a little update. It's 12 o'clock now. We started at about 7.30. That's when we finally started fishing. We've had tough luck so far. We've caught a ton of weeds. It's, it's not even that we're picking them up off the bottom. The surface is just littered with weeds. And uh, it's been tough because they'll drag down your line and then they'll go all the way down to the bait. So we're constantly, you know, checking. We've had a couple follows, uh, like I said, through the depth finder. And uh, we're hoping we can pull off one of them. Now, soon we're gonna actually move into a bay and we're gonna go, you know, maybe after some pike with also the possibility of muskie. There's always the possibility. But we're gonna throw mainly little smaller pike lures. Um, you know, not the big old muskie lures, but we're hoping to get into a couple more big pike. So let's do it. Something's going on here, something fishy. We had our uh, thing kind of pop. Feel like you got one on there? No. Can't tell. Yeah, just weeds. Just weeds. Holy cow, so what an eventful session that was. We got the big boat going by out there. Crashing waves, we were trying to get lines up, but we ended up pulling off my personal best pike here, which is nuts because I, I don't know, I've just never really caught a pike this big and this thick. So I catch pike where I'm at, typically about I don't know, you guys have seen like maybe a 24 incher here and there in my, in my local river. This has got to be at least 30 and he's, you know, much, much thicker here. So much better to see. You know, again with the idea of possibility even a muskie out here, we knew we could get big pike on it. But that's the lure right there. Okay, here's the pike. Great pike, definitely a PR. I mean, this dude is just huge, you guys. By far a PR for me. And sometimes that's just the way that muskie fishing goes. You can't expect to catch a muskie every time you go out, and that's just something that you have to accept, knowing that when you go out for muskie, you may not even catch a fish. We were lucky to even pick up that pike. I mean, it's just tough going. So if you guys were curious what we use today. Typically when you muskie fish, you have like one lure in the prop wash, that's what this guy was doing, and we also threw this guy back there too, just to try a different size. We also ended up throwing the wonder back there behind the prop. Um, every once in a while. Now for our main lures, we had big old spinners right here. Uh, we had heard the spinners were doing well on Lake St. Clair, but again, we never ended up catching anything. These were just the lures that we were using. And so if you guys enjoyed this week's episode of Try It Up Doors, let me know down in the comments. Also let me know what you think I could improve on. And if you're new, definitely drop a sub. I'm posting weekly content. I just move out to close to two uploads a week. Every once in a while, I'll just skip down to one. But you guys can expect close to two uploads a week from here on out. And yeah guys, thanks for watching. I'll see y'all later.